Tomorrow, votes will start pouring in for these mayoral candidates in Music City. But one candidate is focusing on issues facing the actual musicians. John Ray Clemens is looking at ways to improve and protect the entertainment capital of the South. And as News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson reports, Clemens hopes to keep Nashville's identity alive. Everywhere you go in Nashville, music is somehow ingrained in the culture, whether it be Broadway, Jefferson Street, or any other corner of town. But just because the music is advertised everywhere does not mean it's not hitting a sour note. The people who really drive the industry are being left behind in Nashville right now. So State Representative John Ray Clemens said that while campaigning for mayor, he's heard of numerous issues facing members of Nashville's creative class, such as affordable living close to where they work and perform. Uh, the creative class in Nashville, um, they're overlooked because they, uh, I don't know if they're taken for granted or um, it's not clear always why um, local politicians don't pay attention to that class, but it's kind of the essence of Nashville. Eric Holt is the founder of Love Noise, which focuses on urban music in Nashville. And he said many of the musicians that make Nashville Music City are struggling. And that's why he's supporting Clemens. He's a very passionate person and direct. And he just announced that he plans to increase investment into the Barnes Fund for Affordable Housing to $50 million within five years to help make Nashville more affordable for musicians and all other citizens. He also wants to make recording in home studios legal, and he wants to reinstate the Metro Nashville Film and Television Commission, taking Music City to a new level. I want to be creative city. I think that's what, that, that's what the opportunity we have is just, you know, the entire 360 degrees of the creative community and make this just a booming city when it comes to entertainment. John Ray is the only candidate who's talking to a specific segment of Nashville's community that I believe is extremely important to the fabric of this town. Chris Cobb owns the legendary Exit Inn, which used to be a film house before it became a music venue. And he believes that in order to keep its identity, politicians need to support the industry. And if we're not careful, we're gonna become every city USA and we need to continue to be Music City USA. Jesse Knudsen, News Channel 5. Exit Inn is hosting a concert for Clemens tomorrow on the first day of early voting to encourage people to vote and to share the message of how important it is to support Nashville's entertainment industry.